This is probably one of the quietest rooms in the country, if not the world, this anechoic chamber. The silence to me seems almost complete. There are no reflections off the wall. Let me try a clap. Very strange. There's no, yeah. there's no decay. There's there's nothing. It's, yeah. it's like the noise is just being sucked away. Exactly. Yeah. Sometimes this is called the dead room. It's slightly kind of creepy way of describing it, but you can you can you can kind of get the impression. It's a very dead acoustic in here. When any sound is made, it just dies away almost instantly. Stephen Navard is experimental officer at University College London, where this strange room, this chamber without echoes, has been built in the centre of the city. Essentially, what we want to get in here is lower noise as possible, um, such that you can't hear any exterior, any exterior noises. Um, and uh, in that way, we can make almost perfect recordings in here. Beyond the remarkable acoustics of this room, it just looks remarkable. What is it, about three, four metres, a, a cube of three or four metres, and we're surrounded by these fibreglass wedges sticking out of the walls and the floor and the ceiling. The purpose of the wedges is such that if a noise is made inside the room, as the sound moves out and hits the, the wedges, um, it won't bounce back in again. It tends to get reflected onto another wedge. When people walk into this room, their, their kind of first reaction can vary from, oh, this is lovely and tranquil, I just would love to be able to come in here and relax, to this is really, really uncomfortable and I don't like it at all, I want to get out as soon as possible. And, you know, for some individuals it's very disturbing. So I'm, I'm just going to go outside, I'm going to shut the doors and leave you in here so you can experience yourself um, how you find this, uh, this quality of being in complete silence. OK, thank okay. you. With some trepidation. After a couple of minutes, it's very, very strange sensation. I can hear the blood pumping in my body. My breathing sounds, sounds very loud. I've found silence now and it's really quite uncomfortable after a while. It's a very unexpected, almost oppressive silence. The fact that nothing is reflected back to me means that the sound of my own voice seems strange in my ears. And when I turn my head, I can... I can hear... I don't know whether it's bone or... What grinding, the muscles working. <laughs> now, now they've turned the lights off. I'll give it a minute. Yeah, I think I could stay here a while. I could stay here a while. 